It is Wednesday and that means it is restaurant report card time. Yeah, every week our Andrea Eisen pays a visit to a local community looking for the two places with the highest number of priority health violations. But she also makes sure to high five an eatery with a perfect score. Tonight she wanted to find out about what's happening in Sterling Heights. As we stepped on over to Sterling Heights, it was hard not to find food, food, and more food. And that is all right with me. Naruto Sushi had some no-nos on his last health inspection, 11 priority violations. Now look, sushi lovers are a particular bunch. Believe me, I'm one of them, and rightfully so. So let's go get their raw reaction to our visit. We're very on top of things here. This place is always clean and precise. Would you say you are a sushi snob? <laughs> yes, I would say that about myself. <laughs> food and safety is serious business. And lots of folks really feel that way when it comes to sushi. So some of the stuff we found on Naturo's last inspection are concerning. Like no soap or towels at the hand sink. Raw food next to the ready to eat. Employees preparing food with their bare hands. Now the manager, Maria, fessed up to all the fouls and said all of the issues have been resolved. Right now, there is no issues. Uh, so far, for what I know, uh, health department is working with my boss. There is no, nothing to be worried about. And trust me, the sushi is scrumptious. Or should I say scrumptious? So this week, there was a tie, and not in a good way. A tie for 10 priority violations. Yikes. Amahar and White Palace both specialize in healthy Middle Eastern eats. They may be getting that right. But when we looked at their last health inspections, there were quite a few things wrong. Unsanitized utensils, food cross-contamination, cooling and temperature issues, and nothing to dry your hands with at the hand sink. You know you can't use your pants, right? There was not a manager available to speak with us at either location. So we called them, and employees at both places tell me all of their problems have been put to bed. So come on in and enjoy. You know, when you put family first, everything else seems to fall into place. I'm sure that's one reason why Drago's got an A on the restaurant report card. Well, thank you. You're welcome. That's awesome. We are the original owners. This is so amazing. Thank you. And so is getting zero violations on your inspection. So now, let's talk food. Our specialty here is called burek. It's a flaky filo dough, which is filled with cheese, meat, or spinach and cheese. And that's basically the majority of our business. This is what a whole pie looks like. And we cut this into four pieces. You are a doll. Oh, thank you very much for stopping by. Can we serve you some? Of course. Okay. I never say no to food. Delightful. Love it. Thank, thank you. you. In Sterling Heights, I'm Andrea Isom, 7 Action News. Boy, that looked pretty good, didn't yeah, it? Drago, <laughs> put, that, put that on the list, yes, right? Yes, indeed. And it is the dinner hour, after all. For sure. Uh, hi.